Right, so Terminator Dark Fate, the trailer, the teaser trailer has just come out. Yeah. And we're going to react to it on Cult vs. Current. Look at her go! Not giving a single solitary fuck. Who are they? No idea. No idea. I've got nothing. Looking kind of badass though at the minute, but I don't feel that excited at the minute. Whoa! So that's a Lady Terminator, is it? I don't know, but look at that though. Oh, it looks like scary with the black, like metal. Yeah. Oh, he's made a clone of himself. What? Oh. Wow. Okay. Okay, that looks that sleek. That Terminator looks badass. That looks sleek, I'm not gonna lie. Here she is! <laughs> Look at her go! Not giving a single solitary fuck. Wow. Rocket launcher. This is normal for her. Who are you? Oh, we have a lot of questions. My name is Sarah Connor. Yes. I've never seen one Sarah like you Connor. before. Almost mm. human. Ooh. I am human. Oh, so she got, like mesh skin. Like, yeah. Mesh, like, underneath the skin. Is she like the new Arnie like Schwarzenegger, the like good Terminator? I think so. What are you? Are you? Oh my god! Is he like a retired Terminator? <laughs> I don't know. How does that even work though? Because this apparently works for the timeline of the second one. What does that mean? What? What is happening? Wow, that's a shot and a half. How do we win? We win by keeping you alive. <laughs> Ooh. Cool. So he's a, uh, a got like, liquid metal. Yes. And he can clone himself. Or that whatever. is insane. I always think of how they're going to invent the new ideas for the Terminator. But... That is quite advanced. Tech Noir. Take that there's somebody after me. Uh. I hope that you play this back soon. I need you and Matt to come and pick me up as soon as possible. The police keep transferring me around. Yeah. Look at that hair. The number here is 555-9175. Arnie looks such a badass in this. He's insane. It's because he stole a punk's clothes. <laughs> it just looks insane. You know, studded gloves, the, the big jacket, the I don't give a fuck look. I love it. You are the right Sarah Connor. Sarah Connor? It's Lieutenant Traxler. Look, Lieutenant, don't put me on hold and don't transfer me to another department. Don't worry, I won't. I just relax. Can you tell me where you are? I'm in this bar called Tech Noir. Yeah, I know it. It's on Pico. He knows it. He's he knows there it. a few times. He knows it. This it's his favorite hangout joint. Right, now listen, Miss Connor. I mean, yeah, the club itself, Tech Noir, looks amazing, but it also looks incredibly gaudy. Like, it's all flash. It'd be so much. Okay. Wow. So 80s this scene. I know. It's the, it is probably out of, it is so 80s, it's, it's the pinnacle of it. It's almost ridiculous. Oh. There he is. And look, hey, that guy didn't pay or something like that, didn't he? So. Yeah. And here's the thing, look. Here we go. Oh! And look, look, his face. Well, something I've, not I've only noticed, especially watching like the first and second movie. Like, you can, his eyes, his, his head barely moves. Like when it does move, it is like scanning. And when he like finds a security a camera, yeah. Yes, and when it's targeting, 
it's his, his head stays still, like he, well, his, well, his whole body can move. It's so robotically scary. <laughs> Yes! Ooh, oh! <laughs> Close. This is where the music kind of goes all fade out and slower and kind of like... Yeah, it's now building in. Oh, there's our man. It's so weird, this this horrible killing machine in the bass of like early 80s just colour. It's mm. a real invention there, it's so but awesome. Look at those metal tables and chairs, metal mesh chairs and tables. That is so not comfortable to sit on. There he is! Get down! Yeah. Run! See his little fingers move. Yeah, yeah. See, there, like it doesn't phase him in the slightest. See, I, I, when, I remember seeing this as a kid. Yeah. And it scared me. I, I found Ar Arnie so the, the Terminator is scary in this one, like really frightening. Yeah, because you know this is the man who just had five shotgun bullets in the chest and has no reaction. He's terrifying. Yeah! Oh no! Oh look at the techno arm behind him. <laughs> so good! <laughs> nice! So good! It's just oh! How badass does Kyle Reese look in the trench coat in the Nikes? <laughs> like, it just looks... <laughs> yeah! Everything about this is... It, it, oh, it, yes, it's very 80s, but it's all the badass 80s stuff. It's the stuff that makes everyone just look ten times cooler than ever. Mm. Come on! Oh. Run! Oh, and that get, gets right back up again. Barely a scratch. Just keeps going. Now he's on the run. Oh, you don't want him chasing you. This, this soundtrack in this one is really good as well. It's all like 80s electronic music. Which makes perfect sense for the genre. Mm. Nice. Yeah! <laughs> explosions! Gotta love some explosions. Again, doesn't give a fuck. He's still, he's on fire, and he's still trying to get you. Boop. Boop. Oh, he's got a... Ah, oh, nice. Uh-oh. L19, I got a hit and run There's always like a wimpy kind of cop, isn't there, that gets like <laughs> slaughtered. <laughs> well, you know why? Because he's gonna, yeah, because you have to prove that, you know, fuck the police, you know? That explosion blows uh, on his eyebrows off, doesn't it? I know! <laughs> and now he looks even more sinister at the eyebrows. Singed! Now he's on the road! Oh no! <laughs> Oh, I love this bit when you're going through and then he's trying to hide out in the car in the parking lot. It's so, yeah. Oof. Are you injured? Are you shot? Is this gonna have the part where he says his best line? Well, we'll see. Do exactly what I say. Can't remember. Exactly. Don't move unless I say. Don't make a sound. Yeah, it doesn't I feel say. pity yeah. or pain or remorse. That line. Yes. Do you understand? 
it's so weird, like seeing how Sarah Connor is just like not this help, this just helpless character, knowing full well that in the second movie and now in the new movie, it's gonna just she's just gonna be this wrinkly, crinkled, gritty badass of a woman. I mean, it, she had to start in this. She had, she had to start as a weak character, yeah, in order to have that arc. Didn't this she? is yeah. true. It's just so weird to see her like this because yeah. all I see her is badass now. This is 1L19. Ha <laughs> ha! I love it! Approaching overland. See, it's it's kind of goofy, but it's good goofy. I love yeah. it. It's his eyebrows. <laughs> Someone give him a pencil! I didn't do anything. <gasps> Just imagine if he had a pencil in eyebrows. But like, really it, neat. <laughs> I would have done like one eyebrow raise all like the time. Like the rock. Yes. <laughs> Not a robot. Cyborg. Yes, I love that word, cyborg. He was bleeding. Just a second. Is your head down? Oh no! Chaos reigns! That's some really tight driving! Okay, so we have just watched the teaser trailer to Terminator Dark Fate. Yes. What did you think of it? I like it. I like it. There's a lot of questions. Yeah. But I think that what a teaser trailer does is supposed to keep you on the edge of your feet. You're not sure what you're doing. Yeah. But I like it. Yeah, it definitely keeps it sort of simple. There's a lot of like... It's quite subtle, isn't it? Even though there's a lot, there's lots of action going on, it had that kind of no audio other than music for a long time. Yeah, which made me feel a little uncomfortable until, yeah. you know, till Sarah Connor comes out with a bloody rocket launcher of all things. Yeah, and it's, it's good when you compare the first movie to this movie because you yeah. can see the arc of Sarah Connor. It's completely different, isn't it? It yeah. shows that, the, we, you see, obviously Terminator's point A, right? Mm. This movie, apparently, because the third, apparently the third and all the other movies in between don't really count. Only just Terminator, Terminator 2, and now this one. Oh, similar to like what Halloween has done. And yeah, like, yeah, pretty much. Which, thank goodness, because the other was a bit of a mess. So you can imagine how, to, oh, there is now, she's like in point Z. Like yeah. she's, it's not A to B, this is Z. There's so many steps have taken up to this grizzled moment. Yeah. That I'm kind of excited about. I want to see how that went. Definitely. I mean, she's like, in the in the trailer, she's almost like uh, ter to the Terminator from T two, isn't she? She's kind of got the like a rocket launch. Yeah. Every big gun you can think of. Yeah, actually. She's kind of firing at these Terminators. It's just awesome. It's so awesome. It, I think clearly she is the selling point in this movie. But yeah. the only thing with this trailer that is bugging me a little bit is just what we need. We have there's loads of questions, which is great. So now I'm hoping the next either, the, hopefully the, the the next trailer or maybe a movie will give me a little bit more insight because I'm feeling a little confused. Yeah, probably. But I'm, I sometimes like just to watch the teaser trailer then the movie. I don't because you know sometimes the, the main trailers reveal a bit too much. Yeah, no, so that's true. Uh, so I kind of like the fact that she just hinted at what's going to happen. There's still a lot going on in that trailer, so you can get a good idea. And I like the uh, creepy uh, Terminator that's kind of like black metal. And what it kind of is like... that? It's a combination of like the T-1000 and like this new metal alloy super cyborg of like the T-100. It's like merged together to make this sexy looking thing. Mm. It's kind of a little bit like what they did with Terminator 3 with with that um, ter with that Terminator, with her. Yeah. But more but actually better and more functional because she was she literally just had like a gun for her hand basically that's all she could really do um but yeah i mean that's cool i do like the new terminator i do like the other terminator which almost almost like a mesh like honeycomb sort of situation yeah. with this with her skin yeah that looked pretty cool i don't know i don't know anything about her uh, that's Nothing the first at I've all. seen of that terminator which could be interesting cuz i think that maybe she is the good guy terminator Clearly, mm. but here's other questions. For example, John Connor. Nothing. John Connor's not in this. No mention of John Connor. 
Maybe John Connor's no longer an, a an asset. This new person might be a new asset that changes the future. Mm. Interesting. And then obviously we've got Arnie. What is he? <laughs> but, I mean, in, in the trailer, there isn't much of Arnie. You just see, they just go he, like visit him. He like, he's like, the he's, door. like he's a retired... <laughs> Like uh, Terminator, just in a cabin somewhere. Just living. do you think? Do you think? Do you think? Like, uh, do you think? Uh, like, you know, T one T one hundreds would just say like, "Oh, I've been here for a while. I'm kind of done. Just gonna go into a park and chill. <laughs> I'm just gonna be in a log cabin for a while. I don't know. Maybe, maybe he is not an actual Terminator. Maybe he is the human that inspired the the mold and the body for the Terminator, and now he's just a human. Or maybe he's not. We don't know. There's too many questions. I'm yeah, kind yeah, of I'm too intrigued. many questions. So how, how did it feel watching uh, the Technoir scene again from great. Terminator? It's just, it's, it's like timeless, isn't it? I mean, I've seen that movie so many times. It's just It's great to watch every time. Mm. Um, it's just like, and, and it's, I, I always forget how scary the Terminator is. Yeah. Uh, he's he's great. I mean, I almost think I almost wish that Arnie would have played more bad guy roles because he's great as a bad guy, very sinister. I know? think I think I think the thing is with him is that I think you know, I think he just need really he needs really good direction. I mm. think James Cameron knew exactly what he was doing when he was um you know telling him how to be a Terminator because like I was mentioning before, like his head barely moves but his body does all the movement. You can see all the robotic, like almost turns yeah. and makes it it makes him look more menacing when he's walking through the crowd of colorful characters mm. uh, in it uh, and trying to and nearly blowing up the entire club it's just oh so good yeah it's still that is my favorite terminator movie the very first one i mm. just love i mean as you know i'm like a big into electronic music so it's kind of like the whole score is just perfect yeah and it's just like like that that dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Throughout the entire scene, just yes. so, so, so much dread. Like it's yeah. really great. It is when you think of good eighties, like badass eighties, mm. you think of Terminator in terms of its look, its aesthetic, its music, its style, its story, its idea of science fiction. It's all cool, cool stuff. Definitely. You know? So yeah, it's great to see that one again, and I'm excited for the. I'm, I am excited for the new movie, even where there's loads of like un, unanswered questions. I am really excited to see what they do with it. Yeah. So what did you guys think? Let us know in the comments. That's, the gonna, that's about it today for Cult vs. Current. Uh, we've got some other cool stuff coming up later in the month. We've got uh, an enigmatic play of yeah. Super Mario Bros. 3. We're still sticking on that retro hit. Yeah, because <laughs> we, we, we did The Wizard on the yeah. Trash Tapes recently, last month. Yeah. Uh, so we just we thought we'd play that game. Go for Definitely. it, yeah. And then later on, and then we have, and then at the end of the month we have trash, we have uh, the trash tapes on, and we decided to go. I wanted to watch this movie for a while, and I can't wait. And we're going to be watching Barbed Wire with Pamela Anderson. Why not? Because why the hell not? Yeah. All right. So if, you, if you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like, and if you want to see more from us, hit the subscribe and hit the bell notification if you want to uh, get notifications when we're releasing new content. Yep. See you next time on Cult vs. Current.